question. What's a pair of Doc Martens that nobody's talking about? It's not the 1460s, nor is it the 1461s. And I know for sure it's not the Chelsea boots. Well, this is my new favorite Doc Martens. This is the Tarek Low, and I am slowly loving them. They're very durable. They're chunky boots. The sole is so thick that it weighs more than the 1460s. The upper is made out of cloth, but it's something I can wear year round. But lastly, the color, I got the olive green. So here, that's how it looks on my feet. So after about one whole week of wearing these every day, these are my thoughts about it. The first thing was there's no breaking period. You know, usually with the normal Doc Martens, the ones that people are used to, the leather, there is a breaking period into the leather. Since these are not leather, it was so much easier. I just walked in or I just put them on. They were good. And I didn't have any issues about breaking them in. Secondly, the soles, they're heavier, but for me personally, I did notice a little difference. You know, you notice when you have heavier shoes or anything heavy on your feet. So like, it wasn't too bad for me, but I can imagine other people, if they're used to wearing something light, like Toms or anything of that nature, yes, these can be heavy. I mean, I like just that chunky nature of it. It just looks unique. The color looks nice. But lastly, and I think the most important part about these if you're thinking about getting them are the size when it comes to sizing i had to go a size down from like my doc martin size usually for my other doc martins i wear a size nine but with these they run big so i had to wear a size eight a u.s size eight and i think or i believe this is something important for anyone that's considering trying to get these i enjoy them they look nice they look different so that's why these are probably my new favorite dogs. 